Hey guys, Josh here and happy Friday. I'm so excited for today. We're going to be playing two Pixelia. I hope everybody's doing well. And if you don't know about the game we're going to play today, I actually made a video about it a few days ago where I went through about the first hour of gameplay. It's a lot of fun. Uh, it's basically a life sim game where... Yeah, you're in a city, you just move to a city, and you can do pretty much whatever you want. There's tons of different hobbies, tons of different jobs, and you actually, like, do the jobs. Uh, so, yeah, it's pretty fun, but I'm just getting started, and there's a Kickstarter campaign for this game right now. So, there's a link in the description if you guys want to check it out, uh, if you want to check out the campaign. Uh, but, yeah, the developers, Pixie Duo, um, they're a solo developer, and they sent me a key, and it's published by Crytivo. And yeah, they sent me an early version of the game so I can check it out a little bit early with you guys. So thank you for, uh, thank you to Crytivo, first of all, for sending me a copy of the game. Thank you guys for hanging out with me and checking out this game together. And yeah, let's just get into it. And hi, Asuna, Jilju, stranger. Nice to see you, Peppermints, Enamel Light, Cat. I hope everybody's having a nice. Friday. I hope you all had a good week. For me, this week, I've been so looking forward to playing this game. I've been thinking about this game every day, and I wanted to play it, but I wanted to wait for the stream. I wanted to discover it with you. So it's been a hard, well, not a hard week. Well, it's been hard not to play this game, but I've had a good week. Other than that, I've just been resisting the urge. There's a very strong urge to play this game. Hi, Dizzy Panda. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for joining us. So, yeah, this game is basically... I don't know if you've played the GBA Sims game or, like, the DS Sims games. It kind of reminds me of that. Uh, mixed with, like, RPG. A stick RPG. I don't know if you know stick RPG. But, yeah, anyway. Let's get back into it. So, we're going to continue pretty much exactly where I left off in my video. So, I just finished my first shift at the restaurant. And... I got asked what was my dream, and I could choose, like, business guru. There was, like, um, rock star, supermodel, like, professional basketball player, like, lots of stuff. And I chose artist. So we're going through the art path for this playthrough. Hi, Banshee. Welcome. It reminds me of a JRPG design for characters. Yeah, it's a old, kind of, like, yeah, pixel art. Um, does this game have any release date or early access date? Uh, you should check out the Kickstarter campaign. There should be a roadmap. Uh, I think they said the full release is planned for the second quarter of 2024, which seems to be, like, not very far from now. So I feel like it might get delayed or something. Um, but yeah, I think they're going to do, like, early access and everything, depending on the tier that you back on Kickstarter, like Alpha or Beta. Uh, so you, you should check out the Kickstarter page for sure. But uh, right now they say Q2 2024 for the full release. And they are planning a Switch version too. So if you guys want to play this on Switch, um, they say May 2020. Oh, did they update? May? That's very soon, right? Okay, why is the loading screen taking so long? I'm, I'm kind of scared now. I'm scared. I've never played any of portable sim games. On, only the original on PC. Yeah, the Sims games on... The handheld ones were actually pretty fun. They were very different. But, yeah, they were very fun, though. They were more, like, story-driven. And you were, like, walking around the city doing doing lots of things. Um, Alpha release is December, and that's as much as I know. Oh, that's pretty soon. Okay, what's happening with my... I really wanted to, like, avoid playing the game before the stream. But maybe I should have played a little bit to make sure... <laughs> To make sure that my save file is actually working. Uh, I'm glad to catch... I got... Oh, sorry. Let me start over. I'm glad I got to catch a bit of stream while at work. Safina, I'm glad you're able to catch a little bit of the stream as well. I hope we can make your work day a little bit more fun. I backed them on Kickstarter. I'm so excited for this game. Nice. I'm glad to see that their Kickstarter is doing pretty good. They met their goal. But now they are starting to reach some stretch goals as well. Okay, what's up with that game? Um, 
not going well. <laughs> What's happening? Hi, Shay. Nice to see you. I hope you're doing well. Um. Okay. Because I just did an update. Oh, I think that's it. There was an update for the game that I just did. Maybe that's what messed everything up. Is it gonna corrupt my if I if I just close the game? I'm terrified. Okay, I'm gonna mm, I'm gonna close the game. I'm so scared. And we'll do it again, we may because last time I played over an hour, I kind of don't want to start a new save file, but at least I know like where to go, what to do. So even if I have to start over, it's not too big of a deal. But I'll try to do that, and then I'll try to see if there's a way to like revert the whatever the update. If there's a way to like revert the update, I don't think there is, but uh, I'm gonna check. If not, uh, I'll just. Create a new save file, I guess. Oh, I heard something. Oh, I'm hearing some sounds. I was not hearing sounds before. Uh, hi, Piper. Welcome. I hope you're doing well. If it doesn't work, when I do start to... If it doesn't work, I'll just start a new save file of this one. Um... Yeah, they moved it to the 50k. I've been keeping an eye on it. Super excited for the game. Yeah, their current their campaign is doing pretty well. Hope it works. This game looks so good. Yeah, well, I think we may have to start over, which is a bit of a shame because some of you guys, who, if you've watched the video, you've already seen the beginning of the game. I was looking forward to like progress more. Yeah, I think we'll have to start from the beginning. We'll just start a new save file, and I'm just going to kind of, like, try to go a little bit faster through it. Uh, so we can actually make some kind of catch up to where we were. The save might be corrupted after the... Yeah, maybe it's something like that, because... It's, like, just a very alpha version just for content creators. So maybe the update messed up the save files. I'm, I'm not going to delete it, but I'm going to start a new one. I've missed so many streams I... Hope all are well. Stranger, yeah, we missed you. I was just, actually, I was thinking about you today. I was thinking, oh, like, I haven't seen her in a while. I hope she's doing fine. Well, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're doing good. Sorry for making you wait a little. So I'm just going to summarize uh, because we've been through this in the past. Uh, but you just moved to this city and you got to uh, create your character. So I'm just going to try to go a little bit quicker. Apparently, there's going to be more hair color later on in the game. Uh, there's like a hair salon or something, and you'll be able to customize your character a little bit more. So you can have facial hair if you want. Uh, let's wear some pants. Maybe we can do black pants. And Let's do red t-shirt. I had a green t-shirt last time. You know what? Let's do white t-shirt. And... Uh, let's do the bean, the black beanie. And I didn't think I'm going to go... So if you've not seen the video, uh, you can choose traits. So kind of like in The Sims, and these are going to determine um, how your character wants to spend their time. So they're going to have like kind of like desires, like in The Sims. They, they will want to do certain things. Uh, so there's social, romantic, ambitious, creative, athletic, fun, foodie, and bookworm. So I'm just going to recreate the character I had before. So I'm going to pick ambitious, creative, and athletic. And my name. And uh, let's get started. Uh, hello, Josh. I don't know if you recognize my name, but I've been watching for years, and I just want to say after years of being a fan, you're still the most delightful and positive gamers. I game, gamer I watch. Blossom, thank you so much. I don't know if I recognize your name. There's a lot of people that use the name Blossom, but I'm glad I'm glad to see you, and I'm glad to hear you've been tagging along for quite some time. Uh, leave this save. Like in my time at San Rock, my old save file I deleted were revived in the last... Yeah. Well, I've I've only played for like one hour, so if I make enough progress today, I'll probably catch up. But yeah, I'm gonna leave it just in case. 
Yeah. I'm so excited for... I hope you guys will get to play this game soon. So here's Pixelia. This looks like the old GTA games, especially the cars, like GTA 1 and 2. I don't know if you've played them. Like the top-down view. Yeah, so you can play basketball. Uh, you can do boxing. As you can see, there's a gym there. Hi, Gizmo. Welcome. All right. Old guide for the new citizens. So I got to go to the real estate office, which is right here. So we go left and down. Uh, okay. Activate waypoint. So you got needs, just like in The Sims 2, so hunger, energy, and toilet, hygiene, and mood. So you got to keep an eye on those, and you can run with shift, move with WASD, and first things is going to be getting our apartment. So let's go to the office. Reminds me of a Habo Hotel. It kind of looks like it has a pretty similar art style, right? Yeah. I never played the Habo Hotel, but I do know. I do know what it looks like. I played three GTA games in my experience so far, but I don't think it'll be for me personally. Yeah, but there's so much you can do in this game, though. Like, there's there's farming. If you want to be a farmer, you can be a farmer. If you want to... Like, there's just so many things. The cards remind me of the PlayStation GTA games for sure. Like, the very first game. Yeah. Are they on PS1? I thought the first games were just on PC, but I don't, I don't know. I might be wrong. Maybe they were on PS1 too. I, I remember I played them on PC, but... Um, okay, all right. So, yeah, basically what he's saying is that uh, he has an apartment for me. And I'm going to get to one uh, week of free rent, but I'm going to have to do a little bit of cleaning up. And you can see that later on in the game, there's going to be different flats that you can get. Uh, and you can either rent them or buy them. But of course, for now, we'll have to rent. And this one's kind of far away from every. It's kind of far from downtown, right? So it's kind of a pain, but it is what it is. At least we have a place to stay. So let's go out there. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Yes, if you're enjoying... If you're excited for this game, feel free to leave a like. It's going to help the stream and it's going to help the game too. They're still working really hard on their Kickstarter campaign. Uh, you've got your first home for free. Inspect the conditions. All right, let's go. Uh, maybe we should take the bus, save some time. So we can uh, go here. 30 minutes, 40p. Let's go. There's a police station. I think there's going to be crimes in this game too. So if you want to go the criminal route, that is something you will be able to do. I'm thinking about backing, but I'm just not sure. I'm going to watch the stream and then think on it. I didn't catch much of the last one. Yeah. There's still time. I think there's still about one week left. So, All right. So first, we're going to clean... Little mini game, you just oh, you just need to hold E for cleaning. Pretty much all of the actions in this game are like interactive or like mini games. I've been playing Harvest Moon, but so far I cannot get into it. I'm going away this weekend, so I'm hoping to pick it up on the train. I won't give up. Yeah, for me, Harvest Moon wins of Anthos. I'm still working on my review. I I played it for about like 35 hours now. I finished the story and everything. I'm still but it was really all over the place for me with that game. Like, the first one or two hours I enjoyed, then I got stuck for, like, between five to ten hours. It was kind of, kind of slow, and I was losing interest. And then after ten hours, it started becoming more interesting. And then at one point, it started becoming 
less in- it, it was like the pacing was all over the place so i do feel like you need to like i don't know for me in my mind a good game should be good from the start until the end but i feel like uh yeah winds of Antos is just like all over the place like i enjoyed some of it but not enough yeah and I'm struggling to <laughs> to put it into words for my review without like sounding too harsh, because there's definitely some stuff that I did enjoy about the game. Uh, oh, hi there! You must be the new tenant living in this flat. I'm Jane, your neighbor from next door. It's so nice to meet you. I also knew the previous tenant. Uh, she seemed like a nice person, but she had this awkwardness in her personality. But who am I to judge, right? In any case, I'm confident that I will get along with you just fine. You've just moved in. Uh, you j- you've just moved in, haven't you? I guess there's no furniture yet, is there? Oh, you know what? I was just heading inside to cook. How about you join me as my guest? With your place still lacking furniture, you might not have everything you need to cook a meal. So let me show you some pics in the end hospitality. Come on in. Uh, I also hate I couldn't customize my character much. Well, I'll keep going. Yeah, it was just like skin color, hair color, eye color. I also wish there was a little bit more character customization um it's because the game has an open world element but i feel like even open world games i feel like a lot of like for example breath of the i, I know it's not fair to compare these two games because the budget is different but I, even, even most open world games i feel like they can be fun from the start right I feel like the pacing with Twins of Antos is really all over the place. Just like at the beginning, they ask you to get silver for the barn. And it's like so hard to get compared to like what you did like earlier in the tutorial. I just feel like it's very unbalanced. Um, open worlds are fine for me. It's just slow. Yeah, it, it's a slow game. Please make yourself at home. My cat Whiskers seems to be quite curious about you. I was thinking about cooking a classic pixelian dish. I'm not sure if you've had the chance to try it before. I will dice some vegetables and start setting up the meal on the table. In the meantime, would you mind handling the dessert? There is a list of recipes on the drawer. You may want to check it out. You can find anything you need in the fridge. Feel free to take what you need from there. So let's start cooking. I love this part of the game. I love you just move in and you get like your neighbor like welcoming you and you gotta cook something together I, I find that so wholesome i don't know it just makes it feel so real so uh, we gotta take the flour the water we're gonna make some dough so if anybody's just catching the stream i already uh making a salad oh oh need okay oh that's why i clicked on the wrong thing yeah, I, I've already. If yeah, if someone just arrived on the stream, I already did that before because I made a, a video on this. But um, my previous save file is not working, so I have to start over. With so many decent cozy games, hard to justify spending time and money on things that don't keep you engaged the whole time. Exactly. I feel like recently. I don't know. I feel like, for example, if I'm harsh on a game, a lot of people will say I'm harsh. But, yeah, there's just so many games releasing now every month. And we can't afford the time and the money to play all of these games. So, I think it only makes sense that... Like, I don't know what I'm going with that, but... You just have to eliminate some of the games, right? Some of the games, if they just can't compete with the other games, you just gotta... Filter them out and just stick with the best of the games. And after all, if, you are, if you're a game developer and you're making a farming game, you do have to know that there's a lot of competition and you'll have to make sure you'll have to make sure your game is up to the standards or up to the competition, right? Sometimes you have to be honest so people don't waste money. Exactly. Hi, Brendan. Welcome. Thank you for joining me. I hope you will enjoy your meal. Thank you. I've always believed in having good relations with our neighbors. It makes living here so much more enjoyable. By the way, you haven't had an opportunity to decorate your home yet, have you? Not sure if you would be interested, but my mother runs a store where she often gets her hand on spare things that she's willing to give away. 
She might be able to assist you in getting started with furnishing a left from her. I will inform her about you before your visit. I have to warn, though. She has been a little, little bit moody, so I apologize in advance if she says something mean. Your wonderful cake got me thinking that she may not feel this much, but I'd like to offer you this book as a gift. I feel like if they pour this to the Switch, they will probably have to make the text bigger. Because I don't know how, how it is for you guys. It's not too small for me, but it is pretty small. It has lots of recipes. Okay, she gave me a recipe book. I didn't get my cow because they changed the pre-sale, so it wasn't released in Japan. Yeah, even a lot of people, I think in Canada too, they didn't get uh, the cow. So if, if you're in Canada and you ordered the pre-order edition that was advertised with the cow, even in Canada it was advertised with the cow, but they didn't send the cow. So yeah, their whole like pre-orders, uh, like the whole release was a little bit of a mess. Yeah. I talked to the dev about adding a roguelite feature where this game will be new each time you play it. Ooh. But I feel like this is probably like a very long game, right? Though, like... I don't know what would you add, but I feel like you already have so many different ways to make it different. Like you can choose different traits, different hobbies. Whereas usually like a roguelite is more like... Games where you do like one run is like 30 minutes and like everything is different. Like the dungeon's gonna be different and things like that. But this game is gonna be like a pretty long playthrough, so I'm not sure what what kind of roguelite elements you'd like to have. Um text is small, yeah. It's small for me, but I'm not in full screen. Hello everyone, I hope the full release is soon. The full release should be for some time next year, if everything goes well. But there should be, like, depending on the... If you back it on Kickstarter, depending on the tier, you might get to be able to play as early as December. Because even the build that I'm playing right now, I feel like it's pretty advanced. All right, let's go pick up our furniture. Uh, how is this game compared to Super RPG Live? Oh, I'm not familiar with Super RPG Live, so I'm not sure. Uh, you look so much like how my daughter described our, her new neighbor. Am I accurate in my observation? Ain't that delightful. You must consider yourself lucky to have a kind neighbor like Jane. Anyway, let's put the small talk aside. You are doing me a great favor by clearing out these useless stuff, you know? Uh, I was planning to throw them out anyway. I hope you won't develop a habit of constantly depending on, depending on others for something free. There's a job office in Upper East Pixel 10. They might help you to learn how to stand on your own feet. Anyway, take what you can and leave. So we got some plants, a lamp, uh, some tables, and a counter. And when I played last time, so maybe that's fixed now because there was an update. In my first save file, I had some issues with the furniture placement. I have no idea who I should vote in the presidential race. Oh, combo. Let's chat with with him to chat so the chatting is kind of like in the sims so you got different categories like talk joke flirt rude rudeness threaten you can blackmail them you can demand tribute uh you can flirt but let's start with just some chit chat just to get familiar with him oh he looks angry look at his face oh yeah relationship decrease chit chat failed Let's try deep bay. Oh no, I need level three. Let's try another chit chat. Uh, there are so many different categories here. They're giving the option. Yeah, that's one thing I love about this game so far. It seems like they just give you like so much freedom. There's just so many things like, in terms of like traits, in terms of jobs, even like in the relationships, there's like just so much you can. Okay, that guy is not. Let's be rude to him. Let's intimidate him. Relationship decreased, yeah. All right. He doesn't like me too, too much. A rogue light will be setting. You can turn on and off. It will change certain things like events, prices of stuff, the NPC traits and relationships will switch. Certain aspirations not available. Oh, I see. Um, 
there's no introduction. What do you mean there's no introduction? There, There is... Oh, you mean like a character introduction to get to know them? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if the characters really have like different personalities or if they're... I don't know. Can you blackmail him? So I tried blackmail him in the when I first when I had my first look in the video, but uh, you need to be able to threat th threaten them, intimidate them successfully first. So it, it's kind of hard. You have like a two percent success rate or something, and then and then you can unlock the blackmail. So it's kind of something you cannot do at the beginning. And. No, no, I think I'm I think for the blackmail you need to know their secret. And anyway, we can try later on. But I know when I tried it didn't work. I think yeah, I think that's it. I think you need to know their secret. I think last time I tried it said you don't know this person's secret. Uh oh by the way, I know if I go to the bank, I can get a credit card. We did that last time. Uh, you gotta hear God. Yeah, I think so. I think you need to get like a gossip from someone else or So I'm just gonna get a little credit card here. So because I just have 300 coins now So with that My maximum is 1000 and of course you'll have to make sure you pay your card every every Sunday Otherwise, there's gonna be interest fees also, when you go to jail, you can learn skills, meet NPCs, crafting skills. You'll also lose friends. Friendship progress with NPCs while you're in jail. Oh, I see. All right, so let's go to the job office. I'm already progressing faster than my first playthrough because I guess I already know, like, exactly where I'm going and stuff. Uh, I know the job office closes at 5 p.m., so got to make it in time. And after that, once we're done with the tutorial and I can just catch up on where I was in my first playthrough, then after that, maybe we can just take some time to explore the city. I don't know if there's a bicycle or something to be a little bit faster. I know there's some cars and motorcycles, but um, yeah, we're going to get a job. And then after that, maybe we can just explore, just explore slowly and chill. All right, so this is Bruce. Welcome, I'm Bruce. I will be happy to help you find the most suitable job for you today. Let's see, we have job openings suited to a variety of skill sets and interests. I encourage you to try out any of the jobs to find the perfect fit for yourself. You can always resign and apply for a new job at any time. Uh, here's the list of available jobs, but unfortunately, some of the positions were already taken by others. So, yeah, the only position available is at the restaurant. But as you can see, there's other stuff like programmer, baker... Cleaner, butcher, but for now, I'm going to go with waiter. 250p per day. Plus tips. So that's good, right? Uh, let's apply. Congratulations. I got a job. So easy. And uh, All right. So let's go uh, to our workplace, meet our boss. Hi, Josh and everyone. Woke up past my alarm for the stream. What did I miss? Mickey Monkey, welcome. You didn't miss too much because actually, I don't know if you saw the first look video, but my save file is kind of broken. I couldn't load my save file, so I'm starting over now. I'm just trying to catch up on where I was. So I just created my character. I got my furniture. Uh, I got my credit card, and now I'm going to do my first shift at the restaurant. Aren't you the fresh meat Bruce found for me? I'm not sure if you are cut out for this job, but, well, you are here. That's something. Not where you'll do just fine. It's not rocket science. All right, so let's get to work. So, basically, um, this starts at 4, 4 p.m., right? Oh, yeah, so you know what? It's 3.50, so we're right on time to work on our first damn... I feel like I'm so productive, uh, more productive than the first time I played. All right. 
You cannot work right now? What do you mean? Oh, no. Okay, I'm working. So you can see the orders at the bottom right. The first time I played, I didn't even see that. But yeah, in the bottom right, you can see the orders. And so you can check the little picture. And then you go to the chef. You click on what the person wants. You wait until it's ready. And then the someone else wants oh, uh, someone else wants this. Yeah, the first time that I played, I didn't notice the orders in the bottom right, so I was trying to look at the bubbles and like remembering all the bubbles that everybody wanted, and I got so confused. But now it's a lot better, so I think I might be able to. Uh, maybe I can get a pretty good score today. The dev also mentioned UI templates for the screens and colors, so you can customize the colors and how the menu look with all the buttons. Oh, I see. Yeah, I think the UI looks pretty fine. But yeah, if you can customize it, I guess that could be nice. Yeah, I'm doing so much better. So this is kind of like Diner Dash, I guess, if you guys played that. Kind of like a simplify. Oh, why I cannot? Uh, okay, let me order. It's not letting me grab. Okay, let me order two more. It's not letting me grab that thing. Oh, I got it now. I got it. Never played Diner Dash, but her Diner Dash is so fun. It's kind of an older game now. But it was really fun. It was just like we were just working at a restaurant and like clicking. Like it was kind of like a time management game. Where you had to like take orders, set people, clean the tables. And it was just like very, very hectic, very crazy, chaotic. But it was a lot of fun. I feel like we always end up talking about Diner Dash in those streams. <laughs> it's so fun, honestly. Uh, all right. This... I know what happens if you have an extra dish. Like, that dish is not going to be served. I wonder if you lose money for it at the end. Or All right, this one is for this girl. It's a good one. Challenge yourself on time management. Yeah. And one thing I love about this game, too, is that there's different part-time jobs, right? So maybe by the end of the stream, we can try... Maybe we can try a different part-time job by the end if... Or maybe because it's the alpha, maybe that's the only one that's available. I'm not sure. Oh, we need another another shaved ice. I don't know if it's shaved ice, but... yeah. Oh, hey, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Mm, all right. This one. The running speed is not that fast, too. Like, if you hold shift, you can kind of run. But, oops. But, like, not that much. All right. We did it. We got an A. It's not too bad, right? Plus a thousand bonus. 536? I thought it was 250 plus tips. Oh, that's the tips plus the bonus. Oh my gosh, that pays so well. And I just paid $20 in tax. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Uh, not bad for the first day. Don't worry, kiddo. If you stick to it, you will eventually get better at it. Uh, there's something that I want to ask, though. It's just out of curiosity. I heard that you have just moved to Pixelia from, well, I don't even know where. And it is really a brave thing to start a new life in a stranger place. You have my respect for that. But what do you want to accomplish in Pixelia? Do you have any big dreams you want to chase? What should we do, guys? So pick a dream to pursue. Dreams will set some goals for you to complete. And upon the completion of each goal, you will receive prestige points that you can spend to get unique items. So there's business guru, artist, rock star, fighter, basketball star, president, family person, supermodel, and bestseller author. So in the first playthrough that I picked renowned artist. I want to see. So increase your painting. Create a painting. Produce five pieces of arts. 
I need to sell paintings. So that's going to be like mostly making paintings. Um, business guru is going to be perform A for seven days at work. Graduate from academy. Complete 10 days at top tier job. So it's going to be mostly like... Oh, at the end, it's going to be create your own business. But it's going to be mostly like working at a... For a, like a company, right? Rockstar. Reach 15 in any musical instrument. Compose a song. Create a band. Create music album. Perform a concert. And actually, it sounds pretty fun. We might... Maybe we could do Rockstar. Uh, elite Fighter. Beat 25 Pixelians up. Uh, get your fighter license. Win first professional match. Become Tier 1 Fighter. Mm. Not this one. Basketball, joint basketball team, win three games, become MVP five times. President, graduate from Academy of Pixelia, create a political party, make a public speech, complete three policies. Oh, so I wonder if those policies can actually like influence, like actually change things in the game. That sounds so interesting. Uh, Rockstar sounds like something you will do on herbs. Yeah, well, I do get very strong like herbs of herbs vibes from this game. Actually, uh, have a successful successful date with someone, own a property, get married to someone, have a child, supermodel, reach five modeling, complete ten photo shoots at photo studio, ten modeling jobs at podium, uh, perfect score five times on the podium, thirty. 1000p from modeling, reach a thousand fame, bestseller author, uh, reach 50 writing, practice writing 20 times, reach 15 writing, complete a quality book, uh, get your book published, earn a 100,000p of book royalties. And criminal is not in the game yet. Oh no, I thought it was locked. I thought the lock, I think it's just the icon. Yeah, it's it's not locked. Uh, reach 100 crime, loot 25 pixelians, luck pick successfully 20 times, crack 15 saves, hack 20 bank accounts, rob bank of pixelia. I think this could be very fun for maybe like a second playthrough. I feel like I want to play the league all the way for the first playthrough, but I feel like for a second playthrough, once you know like the game more, I feel like it could be very fun. Um... Why do you guys think I'm hesitant between artist or rock star? Uh, the dev is also interested in adding a story creator where you can build your own story with NPCs and dialogues creator. Oh wow, that's a lot of that's a lot of stuff. A lot of that seems very ambitious. <laughs> then be able to upload to Steam Workshop so you can play other story. That sounds nice though. That sounds nice. Uh, go for rock star. Let let let's make a poll. Uh, start a poll. What? What's our dream? All right. Let's make a quick little poll. I'm going to drink some water. I don't know about artists. You just draw. <laughs> yeah, well, Rockstar just play music, right? <laughs> But yeah, maybe it's more. I don't know because I don't know how they actually like play. Like, I don't know if the artist you actually like get to draw something like freely or I don't know. I would pick family person. I'm boring. Yeah, I feel like I definitely want to start a. Fa I definitely want to do all of these goals and like have a date, own a property, get married, have a child. I definitely want to do these. But I don't want my whole life to just to be that, right? Um, as a pixel artist, I had to represent. Yeah, while you guys vote, I'm so sorry. I need to blow my nose. I'm so sorry. I'll be right back. Yeah, like Roots of Pacha. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Miggy. 
He could have been a criminal. I think if we do a second playthrough, I definitely want to try criminal. But I think for now, uh, Rockstar 59 artist 40%. So let's go for Rockstar. So my first task is going to be to practice any instrument 50, uh, 20 times. So. Uh, yes. That is quite an uninteresting dream. But impossible? I would say not. Uh, anyhow, while working your way towards a dream, you should always have a backup plan. Something solid, you know? You see what I'm getting at? Maybe something like obtaining a di uh, di diploma could open new doors for you. Consider paying a visit to Pixelan Academy. Their headmaster is quite a friendly man. He should be able to help you get started. Good luck. I know if we're gonna need a diploma to be a rock star, but maybe we can check out the academy and see what they have to offer. Maybe I can learn some instruments there. Um, but I think uh, our task right now, let's see if there's a music shop where I could buy an instrument. I have, how much money do I have? Where's my money? Uh, I have, there's a pop-up blocking my bank account. Oh, it's, uh, okay, no, that's my credit card. I have 1,000. Okay, 1,000, oh, <laughs> there's so many, <laughs> keep, Ping, pops, pop ups keep coming, blocking. Anyway, <laughs> 1000. Oh my gosh. Oh, farming shop unlocked. Yeah, maybe we can do some farming too. Uh, okay, 1041. Yeah, that's our money. So we can probably buy some kind of instrument with that, right? So let's find a music shop. Well, they want me to visit the academy, so let's go to the academy. Maybe they will guide me a little bit. Well, it's 11 p.m. You know what? Let's go to bed. Uh, our house. Okay, our apartment. Let's go take the bus. Bus stop F. Um, This game is pretty interesting. It's really fun. Honestly, I'm really enjoying it so far. There's, like, so much things you can do. And now I'm pretty much caught up with uh, where I was in my first playthrough, so it didn't take too long, honestly. I was able to catch up pretty quickly. I made a lot on my first day. Alright, and now let's try to place the furniture. So last time, that's one thing I was struggling with. Oh, I see. So, okay, I don't think you can rotate the furniture, but you need to click, click on it. Oh, the counter, the chicken counter, uh, chicken. <laughs> the kitchen counter is different though. The counter, it's kind of weird. I cannot, I cannot place the counter against the wall for some reason. Yeah, so the furniture placement is kind of weird. Like, I want to place it against the wall. It's not letting me. So I'll place it here. The other things, I have, I cannot place, I need to click on them and then I need to click on place it. And then I can place it. Well, it's kind of. I don't know, it's a little bit not very intuitive. But you can place stuff on top of things. Yeah, so that's my house. It looks like a big mess right now, but... Yeah, so I do hope they improve the furniture placement because it, it doesn't feel very intuitive. Everything else so far has been feeling pretty good, but... Um, and yeah, dreams that you see will affect your dream bar, which will affect your mood when you wake up. All right. My dream, you are seeing a funny dream. Oh. It was written like green on blue. It was hard to read, but... Yeah, apparently I had some kind of funny dream. Alright, so this morning, we're gonna go to the academy. Afternoon. Well, after that, we're gonna... Um, yeah, buy an instrument. 
Try stepping closer to where you want to play. Oh, maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's like in Paleo Pines, where you have to like be close to your furniture. Maybe. Maybe, but I feel like I was able to place it far away, far away from me, even if it was as long as it was not close to the wall. I don't know. We'll have to try more a bit later. Um, academy. So here's the hospital. So maybe you can get. Maybe you can work. Maybe you can be a doctor. I don't know. Uh, or maybe you can get sick. Yeah, I think you can get sick in this game actually. In the menu, last time I saw. Uh, there's like. Hair diseases. Virus name, health loss, resistance. Uh, so you can. Oh, you can see all the viruses here. All the different types of viruses and they're they're gonna make you lose hp so hopefully we don't get any diseases maybe it's a bug i watched a different playthrough and they were able to place the furniture against the wall oh maybe it is a bug yeah i don't know that's yeah, kind of annoying especially as the apartment is so small uh, oh we can lock pick the door oh i don't have any lock picks okay well let's wait until it opens it opens in 10 minutes there's no point in trying to force our way through let's just wait a little bit all right what's i'm curious to see what the academy is like like do you actually have classes how how does it work there's like there's a little cafeteria there's a little washroom i swear to god if i have to listen to one more complaint about the cafeteria food what are you here for don't you see i'm busy uh, hold on. You are not a student here, are you? Well, then you should absolutely know there's nothing wrong with food we sell here. I presume you might be interested in attending our academy. Well, welcome. I apologize for not creating a better first impression. Um, let me give you a brief overview of how things operate here. Typically, you pay for classes uh, you attend until you complete your studies and graduate. However, considering our somewhat awkward introduction, why don't you try out one class for free? Oh, that way you can assess the quality of our education firsthand. After that, you can come here to discuss your further educational plans. It may be costly, but it surely is worth it. I don't have any money right now, so I think I'm not going to do that. But maybe for later on. We Anyway, we have a free lesson. Talk to Mr. F F Fuchs. Let's say Fuchs. I'm not too sure how you're supposed to. <laughs> F-U-C-H-S. And complete... Payment. Um, all right. So, where's my? Oh, I need to speak with Mr. Mr. Fuchs, right? Uh -huh. Life sims are fun. Maybe you could also try Tomodachi Life on that modded 3DS. Yeah, I never played Tomodachi Life, so that could be fun. Yeah, that name. <laughs> I almost. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's an interesting name. I don't know. If, is that a real name? Fuchs? Fuchs? Uh, check out profile stats education to see about your college schedule. Okay. Pay? No, 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 no. He's trying to scam me. I don't want to pay. Oh. Uh, playing. Oh, my character wants to play the keyboard. I'd better go to toilet. Oh, so, okay, yeah. Is that an all gender toilet? I think so, okay. Let's use the toilet. <laughs> right. I love how there's like a little mini game <laughs> for pretty much everything. And uh, can we wash our hands? Oh, no. No hand washing. Um, okay, so attend one of the classes. Okay, so is there a music class? So, start lesson, but I want to know, okay, well, maybe it's just a general class. What? Ah, H, D S, oh, wait, what? Oh, catch the letters in target color when it, oh, green, oh, I need to catch the green. It, it started so suddenly without any warning, right? Like, I wish there was a tutorial beforehand. So, I need to press E when it's the color in the little square. Yellow. Okay, this is embarrassing. There's no yellow. There's no yellow let. Oh. Oh, I need to guess the word. 
There's like barely any, there's no yellow letters. But I like how you actually have to do the, the class, right? That's pretty fun. This reminds me, do you, have you played Persona 5? There's like the little, uh, ah. Sometimes you get like, you're in the class phases, you, you get like little questions. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. This is so hard because you sit for like not even one second, right? And I'm trying to like keep up with everything and trying to explain it as much as better as as much as good as I can. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. Do I have a time limit? Cash the letters, score seven. Mistake minus one point, success five points. Well, that's embarrassing. Oh, which one is the correct answer? Remnis? Remnaski? Remnaski? Well, it's Remnis. Okay. I mean, that's the only word. <laughs> that's the only actual word, so... That's a tough... It, it's really hard. It doesn't, like, give you time. Oh, yeah. I failed to pass this class. Wayne. Hey, new kid. Pretty good start for your first day, don't you think? <laughs> Not really. Uh, I see that it might be a bit intimidating to be the new student around here. But don't worry, people here are quite welcoming as long as you stay true to yourself. Would you like to hang out after school sometime? There's a nightclub in the south of Pixel Island, a restricted area called Bottom Town. Uh, they allow people to enter there only during night. It's a bit sketchy place, not gonna lie. Uh, but you gotta take risks if you want to enjoy life, you know what I mean? And I almost forgot to introduce myself. Call me Wayne. If you ever choose to make an appearance at the club, I'll see you there. Oh, some... <laughs> Nightclub. <laughs> yeah, that's an interesting name for the... <laughs> neighborhood. Uh, some earlier mentioned the game looks like Habu. Yeah, it does look like Habu Hotel, right? Yeah, <laughs> lots of interesting names with like the principal and everything. But anyway, uh, I don't think school life is for me, but maybe we can try to go to the nightclub later tonight. But for now, I need to work on my dreams. I need to get... Uh, I need to buy musical instrument. Oh, is there... I think I just need to like walk around until i kind of like discover it yeah oh music store there it is all right let's see is there anything can help you with interact all right so uh blue drums 1900 piano so there's piano drums guitar Oh, the price of the microphone, I can't see. Oh, 780 for this one. And this one is off screen. Uh, guitar, the, it's off screen. 1000. Sound speaker, your neighbors will hate it. Well, I don't want to do that to Jane, but. Okay, I think I'm going to start with the microphone because that's the only one that I can afford without like having to use my credit card. Uh, can you practice singing or sing a song? Okay, let's do microphone. Should we get speakers? I don't know if we need a speaker. I want to see if Jane is actually going to say something. You know what? Let's start with just this. Pay with cash. Yeah, we got a microphone. All right. Let's make some musician friends. Who's that? Who are you? Oh, they're just generic people. Well, who is she? Joyce. Um, Let's chat. 55% chance. Ooh, it worked. She's nice. Uh, what about... Should we try to flirt with her? 43% chance. You guys think we can do it? Oh, no effect. Okay, let's try... A joke. Do impression. Oh, I need comedy level 5. Oh, she's happy, I think. Oh, yeah, she likes it. Oh, my gosh. We're doing good, Joyce. Joyce and I. Uh, and I think it's increasing probably my, my skills, right? 
my comedy skills probably are increasing. Okay, let's try another funny story. Actually, plus one. Talk plus one is... This one has more chance and it's the same bonus. So let, let's just stick... Stick to chit-chat. All right. Our relationship's at three. Not too bad. Yeah. Oh, like the way you look. Your charisma will increase your social... Oh, she likes how I look. Uh, boring. Your mood is too low. Crisp and clean. Your good hygiene level seems to please this person. Well, thank you so much. I like her. I want to be friends with her. Um, all right. But with that being said, let's sing a song. Let's go home. Is this like Sims and Stardew combined? Kind of. Honestly, it kind of feels like the Sims. But you actually like control your character kind of like directly. Kind of like the GBA Sims games. And you move around all around town. And it's nice because I feel like I've been wanting more kind of like farm sim or like life sim games. That take place in a city. So it's nice because you're all you're like usually you're always in the countryside right so it's such a nice change of pace to actually be playing in the city uh oh i thought that was my apartment i guess not oh i need to go up it's one more block yeah i want to see more games in the city setting like that so nice you can have a car you can drive around take the bus do so many part-time jobs. That neighborhood is kind of dead, right? There's never... <gasps> Should we go to the casino? I know there's a casino around here. Maybe we can do that while we wait. Or maybe we can go to the casino... Wait, where's my house? Maybe we can go to the casino until 4. And then at 4, we're going to go to the restaurant. To work at the restaurant. And after our shift, we can go to the club. Such a busy day. Is this still the demo content or has it uh, or has more been released? This is the alpha that they sent to some content creators. Um, so it's still like a pretty early build of the game. Play some blackjack. Yeah, I don't know what they have, but. Uh, all right. Oh, whoever said that, I think they were right. You have to be. Oh, yeah. Who said that? But thank you so much for your tips. You do have to be, like, close to the item to place it. So that's why I was struggling earlier. All right. Practice. Starting in three, two, one. Oh. Oh, what do I do? Oh, I need to move. Oh, my gosh. I love how everything is so different. Uh, you need to move with the left and right key. And you need to keep the a uh, little music note on the microphone that is so cute <laughs> it's kind of i will say though if you don't like the fishing in stardew valley you're not gonna like this game because all all the mini games like the school uh well i don't know i guess it depends like like the music is like this but probably each dream is gonna be different so if you do painting, it's probably not going to be something like that, right? It's probably going to be different. But I like it, though. I like... I kind of want to make a playthrough with everything and just to see, like, all the different skills play. I guess I'm struggling. I'm so bored. Oh, my gosh. I need to... I'm so used to, like, life sim games where characters don't have any needs. Uh, I need to make sure my characters... Okay, mood bonus, 31. My singing skill went up a little bit. Uh, okay, cancel. Okay, I need to eat. I need to... I'm kind of sleepy. I need... Oh, I need to take a bath. Uh, Q, E, Q, E, Q, E, Q, E. I like this game more than the school spelling thing. Yeah, the school, the school is not for me in in this game uh, I don't know if all the classes are like this or if there's like different types of classes um, okay mood well hunger I need to eat something okay practice piano I don't have a piano um, I am so bored 
Maybe I... Okay, let me find something to eat. Yeah, I need to find something to eat. And... Can I check? Oh. No. I wanted to see if Jane... Wanted to cook something with me again, but she's not letting me in. Is it written mice on the wall? I don't know. I didn't notice what it was written, but yeah, there, there is some graffiti on my house, on my walls. Uh, okay, I need to find a place to eat. It's so hard at first because you don't know. It's kind of like in real life when you move to a new town, right? And you don't know where where should you go for eating. Oh, looking for models. Like, I wonder if, even if my dream is not model, can I still do it? I think you probably can, right? I think even if your dream, even if you pick a different dreams, I think you can still do. Oh, there's a coffee shop here. All right. Oh yeah, I remember I came here in my first playthrough. Okay, interact, okay. The person is like too far from the counter to interact with. This is Alice. Let's have some... Um, okay, what's going to fill the most hunger for the cheaper price? I think they're all kind of like pretty good balance. Oh, coffee increases your mood. Maybe I could have... I have 271. Let's have a cherry... Let's have a steak. Let's have a cherry cake. The cake fills you more than the steak. Uh, but, okay. And... Uh, espresso. And it's kind of weird, right? There's like there's some stuff that doesn't show that's like showing outside of the screen. Okay, let's do with that. Pay with cash. Okay. Maybe I should buy one for tomorrow too. Is it gonna spoil? I don't think so, right? Let's buy a little sandwich, a little cake for tomorrow. And all right, cherry cake. Eat. Coffee. Drink. Oh, yeah. That increases your mood. Oh, can I play this little game? Is that going to increase my mood? I need to go to work. To I wanted to go to the casino, but... Insert... Oh, I love how you have to actually click on the little coin thing. So, yeah. A bunch of little mini games. So, let's start with Snake. This is a really tough Snake game. Ah. I wonder if it's 5p every time, or... I wonder if you can win something, too. Oh, I'm doing... You know what? I'm doing pretty good. Ha! <laughs> Sorry. Ah! Okay, 70. Not too bad. Uh, let's try game 2. Press jump twice to double jump. Oh. What? Oh, I need to press W. I was pressing spacebar. Oh, I need to... I thought... Okay. Oh my gosh, that's hard. Have you played... You know in Paleo, they added some arcade. There's like a game that's similar to this. That's very hard. I think this one is even harder. Okay, I'm getting the gist of it now. I need to double jump. Actually, that's why I was failing. Actually, it's not that hard. It's not that hard. Oh, but the jumps are getting higher and higher. Ah. Okay. Uh, and game one. Oh, yeah. This one I tried uh, last time. This one's too hard for me. Okay. All right. All right. It's time for a go. Oh, I need to go to work. Uh, okay. It did not increase my mood. Just sounds like one of those pics of a cat with a little app or a very small scream. I have no idea what that means. But oh my gosh, I just got hit by a truck. Let's go to work. No matter what, we gotta show up to work. Oh, you have to pay for parking when you have a car. There's a little parking booth, a little parking machine. Uh, oh my gosh, I'm on the wrong way. So I wonder what happens. If, oh, we can buy. Oh, there's a food uh, stand. Oh, food trucks, tacos, ooh. Oh, they're protesting. What are they protesting? No, they're not. They're not talking to me. 
I was wondering if you could get hit by our car. Yes, you can. So you gotta be careful. It doesn't hurt too much. But... Come on, run. I don't have enough stamina to keep running. So I wonder what happens if you get late. If you're late to work, do you just get paid a little bit less? I'm, are they gonna fire me? Uh, I don't... Oops. Oh my gosh, I keep getting... I got hit two, two times by a car in like one hour. Come on. This is so far. I can't wait until I have a car. I can't run anymore. Alright, here we are, Russell's. Alright, everybody, all the customers are already here. Alright, start working. So let's see if we make less. You cannot work right now. Oh, it always says that, but actually, okay. I got hit two times in an hour. City life is already so <laughs> appealing. Yeah, it's it's a hard life. Okay, this one guy's want this one guy wants fish. Is that fish? Uh, this one here. Uh, no traffic enforcers. I see. Yeah, I'm sure when I have a car, if I do something bad, I wonder if if, if they will start enforcing it. Cause I saw the little traffic, the little parking tickets and stuff. So. I wonder if the rules are gonna apply for us. Uh, the thing with the tomatoes. I wish the food pictures would look a little bit different. And sometimes it's hard to interact with the chef. I'm trying to ask him for another meal, but okay. Uh, and this one, the little thing. This game is so nice. I really hope they reach all stretch goals in Kickstarter. Yeah, me too. They're definitely, they're definitely doing not too bad. Like they, they reach a few of their goals already, so I'm confident. Um, but even without their stretch goals, just the features that they planned, that they already planned, I feel like it's already quite a lot. There's already like a bunch of good stuff. So did I, oops, sorry, I forgot to order for her. There's already a bunch of stuff. Even already, it seems like there's a lot of content in the game. Sometimes it's hard to interact with a chef. Sounds like your average Waffle House. I've never been to a Waffle House. We don't have those in Canada. But I always hear like stories. I, I always see like videos of like people fighting at Waffle House. I don't know what's up with... What's up with the Waffle Houses? I've never been inside inside one of those. Where can you see the money you have? Indicator. Um, I think you can see it when, I'm, when you're not working. Oh my gosh, I forgot to order the food. Sorry. Um, yeah, when you're not working, I think you can sit in your inventory. I don't know if you can sit on the screen at all time. I think you do need to open your inventory. All right, who wants these things? And coffee. Okay, and one thing like this and one thing like that. All right, the coffee. Is that a coffee? I'm guessing that's a coffee. Uh, that person is gonna get mad. Okay. Did it. I did it. And I need to order one thing with the three tomatoes. I have no idea what that food is, but... I'm trying to grab the food. It's talking to the chef. Okay, I got it. Uh, where is the... Okay, this one over there. Uh, which one? Wait. They all look so similar. Okay. Oh, no. What? Oh, my gosh. I think I did the wrong... Ah, I'm not doing too good. I'm not gonna get an A today. Uh, this one. Am I gonna have time to deliver to him, the guy here? Oh, that's the guy. That's Combo, right? Is that the guy I was talking on the first day? And that girl wants the... Oh, that's this one. Um, Is this on Steam, Josh? It will be on Steam, but it's not out yet. This is just a very early alpha build. Uh, okay, for that girl there. Oh, there's an arcade here. I wonder if it's the, the same games. 
Because they're open late, most people go after clubbing. Oh, that's why. So I still got my bonus. Oh, I still got an A. I showed up an hour late. I delivered like one wrong dish. And I still made a bunch of money. Well, not too bad. Not too bad. Waffle House is a dining experience in capital. Uh, the core is straight out of the 50s. You go only at like 2 a.m. for mid-breakfast food and eat among truckers and the sketchiest other denizens of the night. Marvelous. Well, speaking of sketchy denizens of the night, let's go to Bottom Town and let's check out the nightclub. It's 11.30. I don't know if I'm going to be too late. I don't know what are their hours. Um, but let's find that out. Hopefully... Uh, oh, it's here. I need to cross. Oh, that's the most annoying. You have to cross over all the stuff. Hopefully, there's nothing like too <laughs> inappropriate or anything. Uh, Waffle House is the nastiest food, but people go there because it's 24 7, and usually it's the only place open late. I see. Well, that makes a lot more sense. Because I always assume it was like a more like breakfast y, like regular breakfast place. But now that everybody says that it's a place you kind of go late in the night. I guess it makes more sense. Bottom Town is known to be a restricted area in Pixelia where you can enter only during night. Maybe we'll have a Waffle House here. Uh, despite the presence of gangs, criminals, and thieves, here is still a very popular place to visit. I wonder if you can live here. Uh, it owes its popularity to having Nightclub, that's the name of the nightclub, as the main attraction where you can party all night. All right, let's party. Oh, I failed to complete my trade tasks. I think I wanted to play the piano and things like that. Yeah. They sell gross waffles, soggy eggs, and blend breakfast meats with burnt coffee to wash it all down. It's so gross. Huh? Right, can I just go in? Oh, yeah. All right, let's check. Let's party. Ace Club. Oh, okay, the club has a name. It's Ace Club. Wayne. Oh, look who is here. It's the new kid. I'm glad you decided to show up. Uh, you came just in time. We were about to start a dance stuff. Would you like to participate? Oh, yeah. It's just a friendly contest. There's nothing to win or lose. Let's see how talented you are. Is there going to be like a little rhythm mini game? Uh, okay, cool. Quir okay. Uh, wait. Oh my gosh, I need to see which little icon. I'm... It's so hard because the icons are so small. Ah, I'm struggling. Wait, QWERTY and you. Okay, wait, I need to put my fingers for this. Okay, and you need to see which icon. Okay, I wish I was like a practice mode. You need to see what, this is too fast. Honestly, I can't do this. You need to see like which little icon. Which little pose corresponds to which key? And then you have to press the key. I can't even like process like which is w like, it's way too fast. Oh my God. <laughs> um, oh, this is, this was. Mm. And there's like seven keys, right? I, I get it, like, if there were four keys, that would be one thing. Or like. I didn't do anything. How did I succeed that move? Like, this is too hard. Like, they need to rebalance the difficulty for this. I'm just like overwhelmed. <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm streaming, but I feel like even if I wasn't streaming, okay, I got one. And I'm trying to make sense. Like, it's not even like Q is like left or like, like the moves don't correspond to like, a key that makes sense on the keyboard, if that makes sense, right? It's not like if you play, like most radio games will have, like if you press left, it's gonna be a move on the left. If you press up, it's gonna move like up. But like the pauses of the character don't fit the keys. So anyway, it, it, it was very confusing. Uh, I'm not going to lie, it was quite oh, quite impressive what you did, <laughs> new kid. I did like two moves. Uh, you really rocked on the stage. It was fun. Well. 
Uh, if you're up for it, we can spend more time together later. See you around. Wayne is being way too... Na yeah, he's, like, I didn't expect that from him. I feel like the dialogue should be different depending on like if you fail miserably. Wait, wait, why am I out of the club though? It's 6 a.m.? Oh. Okay, we're already... Okay, let's go home. You have a new quest. Dress it up. Uh, there are many things you can spend your money on, but for now you may consider spending it on your look. <laughs> Increase your charisma to 30 by wearing some nice clothes. Uh, is there a clothing shop somewhere? Fighting unlocked. Oh, by the way, I unlocked the... Oh, there's a record. Uh, fighting 101. I want to check the record shop. Um, oh my gosh, that was overwhelming. Oh uh, yeah, I want to buy some clothes. I wish it was more like a DDR mini game. Yeah, me too. I was expecting like a little DDR mini game, just with the arrows, like down, left, right, up. I feel like, what, and like just a little simple music. I feel like it would have made more sense than that little thing. And like the icons are like teeny tiny. Uh, yeah, that mini game was a pain. I hope, <laughs> I hope they change it. So if, is there, there's no dancing dream, right? Yeah, I was gonna say if there's a dancing, like professional dancer career, I would say avoid that one for now. But it's not one of the different paths. Oh, I thought it was like a record shop. It's a recording studio. Oh my gosh, so maybe I'm gonna record some stuff here. Uh, in order to create a music album, you need to have composed 10 songs and 10,000. Uh, you will generate royalties from your... Okay, well, I don't have any songs. Oh, that's nice. Uh, can you pet the dog? Oh, let's see. Yeah, there's a stray dog, right? Yeah, Wayne's hitting on... I feel like everybody's hitting on me in this game. Praise. Oh, yeah. Oh, That's cute. Give a tip 25. Why not? Oh, it increased my mood. Yeah, I need to... Oh, my gosh. I need to eat. Well, I still have my cherry cake. Uh, I need to sleep. Am I gonna pass out? Oh, oh, what's? Oh no, that's bottom town. Okay, let's not go there. Uh, and maybe if you're a criminal, you can go there during the day, right? Okay, so I want to find a cloth. Well, clothing shop. I should sleep first, I think. Let's get our priorities straight. We should sleep. Am I passing out right now? Or am I just succeeding at the? Oh yeah, I'm just going a different area. Okay, okay. Let's let's sleep. Have a little nap, and then I'm gonna practice my singing. And then after that, we're gonna go to work. But I want to buy some clothes. So many protests. What's happening in Pixelia? What what's the president of Pixelia doing? Okay, let's go in. That should be the official motto, bottom town, let's not go there. Maybe it is. Uh, real life me would fall asleep on the bus and miss my destination. Oh yeah, me too. <laughs> me too. All right. Uh, can I see the time? Oh yeah, 11. So I'm gonna wake up, it's gonna be time. To go to work well okay i should not sleep too much because if i uh, my gosh she was snoring so loud i tried to wake up earlier it didn't work um we have to go to work let's sing a little bit and then let's go to work but what i was gonna say yeah i wanted to wake up early because now i'm gonna go to work and after work i'm not gonna be tired so i'm gonna be stuck in the middle of the night, not sleepy. Okay, I'm gonna do that mini game. So I figure that even if I get, I'm, even if I'm late at work, like if I get there at five or six, it's not too big of a deal. That's what I learned yesterday. So I don't mind being a little bit late in that case. Oh my gosh, I'm struggling. Sorry if I'm. I'm gonna read the chat after. 
I need to focus on my singing. <laughs> yeah. just, I wonder if this gets easier once you have more skills. Maybe the little music bar is gonna get bigger. Maybe. I am bored. My character keeps saying, like, in the top left, in the bottom left, you can see the mood of your character and, like, he says things sometimes. And he, he keeps saying that he's bored, but, like, you're singing. You should be having fun. Uh, mood bonus 21. All right. Hey, party people. Hi, Riri Kutai. You just... Speaking of party people, we just came back from the club. You missed that. I want to try this game. Is there a demo? There's no demo available yet. You can back it, back it on Kickstarter to have it uh, access whenever there's an alpha. But for now, they just sent it to a few content creators to check it out. By the way, guys, thank you so much for checking out this game with me. If you're enjoying it, feel free to leave a like on the stream and subscribe if it's not already done. Uh, a young newcomer with only a dream, sleep apnea, and a, m <laughs> a mice graffiti on the wall. Well, I'm doing not too bad. I'm making like $500 a day. Working like just a few hours at a restaurant. It's honestly not too bad of a, of a life. Okay, but it's 4.40. Okay, I think I'm going to take the bus to go to work. Oh, I wanted to go to the casino. I wanted to go to the casino. I think tomorrow the restaurant... I think on Thursday and Friday the restaurant is closed. So I'm going to have two days off. So. Is it this bus stop or... I forgot which bus stop is for my job. I think it's this one. Um, yeah, I'm going to have two days off. So we're going to go to buy some clothes. We're going to go shopping on one day. And then we're going to go to the casino. Spend all of our money. Then we're going to go back to work on Saturday. The only bad thing so far has been your dance moves. Yeah, I need to work on my moves. Definitely. Is, the <laughs> Is that guy on the ground in the park having a panic attack? I didn't see him. I wouldn't be surprised. Me too, park guy. Me too. I want to see new clothes. Yeah. Okay. First, we got to work, though. We got to work a little bit. Should I order a meal or a drink? Both, sir. Okay. Oh, he's ordering a meal. The thing with the tomatoes. All right. Let's wait for that to be ready. Kind of park was doing sit-ups, I think. Oh, I see. Yeah, there's a lot of people working out in this game. Like, working out outside and stuff. Uh, all right. Pizza. I'm not too sure what the meals are. I'm saying stuff, but this looks like a pizza. This the first one looks like something with some. I'm seeing like some radish maybe or some potatoes. Pizza. This looks like like egg rolls or something. This one looks like an omelet with some like cherry tomatoes. This one looks like fish or skewers. This one or maybe this one is fish. Coffee, shaved ice. But honestly, I have no idea. Anyway. Uh, okay. Uh, tomatoes. Oh, two tomatoes. Okay. Can you get married? Yes, you can get married. You can buy a house or buy an apartment. Uh, you can have a child. There's honestly, you can do almost anything you can think of. Oh, and oh, that that meal is popular today. Another tomato. Stop investigating. The food is getting cold. I know. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out what I'm serving them. I wonder if there's a way to increase your stamina because I can't run for very long. Tomatoes and eggs, yum. Yeah, I mean, that's a nice breakfast, right? A little... Okay, I'm just waiting for our... Okay, shaved ice. And a pizza. Can you then turn the child into birds if you don't like them? How do you do that? I don't think so. <laughs> Is that like a reference to something? Uh, who wants the... Oh. Uh, okay, one pizza, one fish. Okay, pizza is ready. One fish.
Sometimes there's like multiple people at one table, but they don't order at the same time or like Sometimes not one of them is not ordering anything. Oh, I need one more shaved ice for is that combo? I think that's the guy that I served him his dish very late yesterday. Okay, so one shaved ice one coffee uh, I thought it was a Mr. Beast reference <laughs> Did Mr. Beast transform people into birds? Uh, Josh, did you pre-order my time at Senra Collector's Edition? I ended up getting three on PS4, PS5, and Switch. Oh my gosh, why did you get that many? <laughs> uh, yes, I did. Well, actually, they're sending me one, so... Yeah, I should have it sometime. But yeah, they're sending me the... Well, I decided to pick the Switch version, so... I'll definitely be checking that out. I'm so excited for it, because I know there's like a little plushie, there's like a little house. That you can build, or like a workshop that you can build. And it looks like so much stuff. Uh, yeah, it looks like a really nice collector's edition, so I'm looking forward to checking it out. Oh, 521, not too bad. It's kind of funny you pay the same amount of taxes no matter how much money you make. I wish, <laughs> I wish life was this easy. Just pay $20 of taxes. All right, so, uh, all right, that's it. My shift is done, it's 11 p.m. So I feel like work, if you can show up late and I feel like I'm making as much money, I wonder if tomorrow I should try or like next time to just go there at like 9 p.m. or 10 p.m. just before the closing time and if I could do a whole shift, right? And get as much money and like not spend too much time. Which one is better, Porsche or Sen Senrock? Definitely has a lot more like quality of life, uh, content, uh, updates, and improvements upon the first game. The The game is also much longer. They recently posted something on Steam. It's like three times more quests and like two times more like villager interaction. There's like so much more content. And honestly, I'm 60 hours in and I feel like I still have such a long way to go. Um, Porsche is pretty long too. There's just so much content in Senrock. I would definitely go for Senrock over Porsche. Uh, I could not make up, I could not make up my mind on which one I wanted the game on. Oh, I see. So you got the collector's edition three times, or like one collector's and like two regular ones. Oh, I'm hungry. How come I just finished a whole shift at the restaurant? They didn't give me a meal. When you work at a restaurant, this should give you food, right? Sometimes I wonder what foreigners think about Pixelia. I wonder. Oh, Mickey Monkey, you've been in Super Seedlings for two months. Thank you. I vote Sandrock. I also only been a seedling for two months, but I feel like I've been here for a long time. Yeah, milestone chat. Yeah, Mickey, you've been here for so long. Thank you so much. Uh, three times of collector's editions. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. What are you gonna do with all the, <laughs> with all this stuff? Oh my gosh, that's a long walk home. I should have taken the bus. I'm almost there. Oh, can we dumpster dive? There's nothing. There's nothing here. Okay, so tomorrow is our day off. Um, I still haven't seen the clothing shop, but I want to find that today. And then casino. Did I just... Am I peeing? What am I doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I peed on the hallway floor. That's so embarrassing. I am... Um, what makes them different? Well, as I said, mostly like the quality of life improvements. Also, there's so much more content. I think Senrock looks better too. I feel like the characters are more developed too. There's just so many more things to do. I started watching since that Filipino Island tour. You're the one with the most views if you search Animal Crossing Filipino. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Yeah, I feel like... Actually, I feel like I visited quite a few Filipino Islands in Animal Crossing. 
And these are some of my favorite islands. My favorite islands in Animal Crossing were all there, like islands based on some countries. So I saw a Thai island, which I really liked. A few Filipino islands. I saw an Indian island. And these were the best islands, honestly. You get to see so many like different food, different buildings. All right, it's 5 a.m. I kind of want to check the casino and the clothing TV studio. Ooh. Okay, uh, I want to check the casino. Uh, no, I want to check the clothing shop. Uh, it's probably... There's like a bigger street right here. It's probably like the main street for shopping. I have no idea. Uh, so let's go down. I haven't played Sandrock, but I'll be honest, the art style was dreadful and the characters were so cardboard thin in terms of personality. My only friend was the demonic pink cat. Yeah, I think the characters in Sandrock are quite a bit better than Portia. Going to shop for clothes and PC pen. Oh my gosh, I forgot to... Maybe I should take a shower, right? <laughs> Maybe I should just take a bath or something, right? Just take care of myself a little bit. I'm so used to games like... Most games you don't have to take care of your needs. And then we'll take the bus to go back down because that's just a pain to walk all the way across the town. That president looks so... Uh, malicious? Mal maleficent? Malicious? Is that the word? Malicious? Uh, and they're all... Um, I think like no less than four characters and recolors of each other because they're identical quadru quadruplets. Oh yeah, those guys, right? Weren't there like seven of them? Just four of them? Yeah, that... Yeah. I never could remember like who, who was who. Ominous. Oh yeah, ominous is a good word. Yeah. Yeah, so if you guys missed the beginning of the stream, you can actually become president in this game. Um, yeah. So that's not something I'm going to be attempting for now, but it is something you can do eventually. Uh, okay, so I took a shower. I need to eat. My mood is... Okay, let, let's sing a little bit. I know that gives me like 20 mood points or something. But I need, I think I need to buy, yes, I want to buy clothes, but maybe I should buy like a TV or something to just like increase my mood. Because honestly, I'm not too sure. Like I'm always struggling. I'm honestly always struggling to increase my mood. So we're going to sing and then we'll check if there's... I think I saw an electronics store. So maybe if there's like a radio or like a TV or some kind of electronic stuff that I can have fun with. Because singing increases my mood, but it takes a long time, right? It's not like instant. And this is tough. I really hope the little bar will get bigger. Uh, you have a new message? Oh. Oh, five seconds left. Oh, it's gonna be a B. I didn't increase my mood. Mood bonus minus one. Why? Uh, oh, I think maybe if your mood is high, it's going to give you more experience points. Practice an instrument 20 times. <gasps> it doesn't even count as an instrument. I thought... I thought it would count. Uh, okay, I need to eat something. I need to increase my mood. I, I, I'm struggling. This looks worse than legendary fishing in Stardew. It is, it is definitely a challenge. Uh, I hope they have a 3DS or game in that electronic store. Make a me avatar there, even though I know you don't like me's. I do not like me's, but that's if they have some game consoles. 
Uh, just concentration face looks like a teacher assistant in college when you just asked a really stupid question. <laughs> I love how your comparisons are so specific. Uh, okay. Mm, I need to find... Uh, music store... Storage shop... Maybe we can check the storage shop. Maybe they have... Like an old second-hand TV or something. Uh, is it one street down? Yeah. Uh, when we first got our Wii, my anytime anyone came to our house, so we'd made them make a Wii on our system, so we'd have tons to play in the, with in different games. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, I think I probably did that too, right? I remember, like, when the Wii came out, the Mies were so, like... So fun, right? <laughs> All right, Sarah, what do you, oh. Oh, it's just, a st I thought it was like a, like a Goodwill kind of thing where you can, I think it's just to store stuff. Okay, I, I thought you could buy stuff there. Hello, Josh, I'm so looking forward to this game. Just stopping in while on break. Hi, Miss Fang. I'm having so much fun, honestly, with this game so far. I'm sure you will love it too. Is that a convenience store? Let's see what they have. Uh, you need to buy an actual instrument for your dream. Yeah, I guess I, I found out the hard way. Uh, Walter. Oh, maybe I can make some. So, Tuna. 36p, 14 hunger. But... At the restaurant, if I buy the cherry cake... It's 75p for 25 hunger. Right. So. Mm, should I try to... <laughs> uh, is it the same ratio? Or... Two nine chip sandwich. Do it now. Potato chips and tuna. Do you, do you do that? Is that something people do? Um, 36 times two, six. oh, I think, yeah, we are doing math, but we're trying, but I think I'm just going to buy two kinds of tuna. Um, yeah. Let's buy chocolate milk. Is there something for my mood? Oh, red wine. Okay, let's do that. It's not... I would not recommend this in real life to uh, increase your mood, but... We gotta do what we gotta do. Alright, so my mood is fine. I just had two big bottles of wine. Uh, I just got my fourth island on out Outpath today. Oh, nice. I think I'm getting close to there, too. I have my third one that's getting pretty big. I need to save, like, 65k. Yeah, I've been playing quite a bit. Uh, are you still enjoying Weir Sekai? Yes, I'm really enjoying that game. I've not played too much since I made my video, though, because... Um, I'm working on so many videos now, so I've, I've not had time to, like, really go back to it. But it's definitely a game I want to go back to. Uh, a sandwich with chips, love it. All that crunchy goodness sounds unhealthy, but very tasty. Yeah, we'll have to try that. Uh, so the casino is here. Should we check it out quickly? But I, I don't want to spend too much time there for now because I want to check the clothing shop. Uh, all right, so. All right. Should we do a hundred P? No. Let's do a 50. Oh, yeah, you can. Okay, 50. So I need to get three of the same. Oh, no, I lost. Play again. Let's try 10P. Let's be reasonable. Oh, 
cucumbers. I should have played more. Can we please clip <laughs> Josh out of contexting? Just had two big bottles of wine. Got hit twice <laughs> in one hour. I gotta be careful with this game. Not to be taken out of context. Okay, let's try this one more time. One more time playing this game. Then we'll try a different game. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. I'm rich. Yeah. Well, I made my money back with this machine. So that's good. I had 600 something, right? At first. Let's try a different machine. Uh, Blackjack, right? Oh, no. That's the wheel thing. Um... Oh my gosh. Okay, so you need to bet. You can bet like on the red. Okay, let me just do some. Let me bet like 50 on red. Spinning. This game is so much fun. <laughs> ah, no. Uh, well, it's okay. All right. Uh, is there. Oh, can you play pool? Oh, no, we cannot play pool. You can buy, oh, 27p9 hunger. Yeah, I think the food is like all the same like proportions, like the price, they're all like kind of like priced the same way. So I don't think there's one food that's like better than other. 30p14 hunger. How much was my tuna? Oh, my tuna was... Oh, yeah. No, they're not all equal. Because my tuna was 36, right? And it gives me 14 hunger. But the dum dumplings are 30. And they give me 14 too. So the dumplings are better than the tuna. It's kind of weird that the food at the casino is cheaper than at the convenience store. But... Um, I wonder if these machines are the same. Oh, yeah. They're the same as... Uh, let's play game two. They're the same as in the other places. Yeah, you would think the food at the casino would be more expensive, right? I'm absolutely loving this game. Honestly, it's so fun. Obviously, some some things still need some work because it's an early build, but I'm really, really enjoying it so 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 far. They want you to stay there. Yeah, but the thing is, oops, you can take out the food, right? So. Because it doesn't consume the food right away, so maybe I can do my, my, my grocery shopping here. Oh, this is Blackjack, right? Okay, let's bet 20. Okay, I'm not good at this, guys. I, so that's 15, right? Uh, oh, 13. It says it here. Never mind. <laughs> um, I need to get to a hit. Oh, 23. Oh, no, that's not good, right? Oh, no. Ah, I lost. Okay, let's play again. Um, Let's bet 30 this time. 10. 19. Stand. Oh, it's a draw. You take your $30. Oh. Oh, so the queen is still worth 10. It's still worth 10, right? I like the king and the jack, they're all worth 10. Uh, 18. Stand. Oh no! Okay, well, that was fun. Well, I didn't spend too much. Six fifty. I think I, I came out with the same amount of money that I came in with, so... Not too, too bad. We still have money for clothes. Yeah, it's pretty fun. Pretty fun casino. I will say. Alright, uh, now, let's... Yeah, I want to buy clothes. That's the thing. That's my mission. Highly recommend Blackjack mini games in any game as money makers if you know when to risk or stand it. Yeah, I'm not very good, but I'm sure people that are good at it will be able to make a bunch of money uh, with that one. Uh, okay, so that's that. Uh, okay, so I need to find a clothing shop. I think it would look cute if the gamer zoomed in a bit. It makes it look like the character is a little chubby. He doesn't look chubby to me, but 
Yeah, I wonder if there's a way to like zoom in or something. No. Yeah, maybe later they will add that option. But actually, I kind of like the zoom out because the the map is quite big. So I'm kind of glad you can see a lot of things. In fact, if I could zoom out a little bit more, maybe I would. Uh, I don't know how to play blackjack, so I'll just let you guys. Um, all right, so, okay. Where's the clothing shop? It's already 5 p.m. Oh, these guys are so cute. This looks like a little grandma, but like... I don't know. <laughs> okay, um... Where's the shop? By the way, I got a message, right? I think... Oh, yeah. I have a phone. App Store. Pix job. Oh, Flirtians. Okay. Contacts. Notifica- Oh, my gosh. Okay, it's... It's just, uh... Yeah, nothing important. Okay. Well, okay. nothing really important then. Uh, there's a hair salon here. It closes at five. I think everything closes at five. But I just want to see where the clothing store. Maybe it's on this street. There's a hair salon. There's a restaurant. Maybe I can find this uh, shop for tomorrow. Zoom dot is better too. You can see the incoming cars. Exactly, right? If it was to zoom in, you couldn't see them. Uh, I think people ask for it to be zoomed in a bit because it's difficult to see different outfits so far with the tiny models. Yeah, well, the outfits are pretty simple. It's pretty much just like colored. Oh, flower shop. Like. It's just like colored pants and colored tops. I don't know if there's going to be more like complex outfits, but for now it's like pretty straightforward. Oh, fur. Oh, no, pet shop. I thought, I thought this was like a clothing shop. Well, maybe we can check the... Well, I'm struggling just to feed myself, actually, so maybe not. Uh, okay, let's have another red wine. Oops. <laughs> okay, I have some tuna. Uh, I need to go to the toilet soon. Oh, yeah, we don't want to have an accident like yesterday. And I need to sleep. So my energy is at zero, so that's not good. Um, photo studio. So everything gets added. No, they don't even. Some stuff doesn't even get added to the map, right? That's the thing. It's hard to find out. Oh, maybe maybe once you go in, once after that they get added. Eating tuna in the street, glamorous urban life. Yeah. Um, having a hard time now. <laughs> Bakery. Where's the clothing shop? Oh, best job for you. Oh, that's the job office. Can you choose your workplace? Yes. So currently, the the, first, the only one I could pick was the restaurant, but there is more that you can choose. I don't know if they're locked. Maybe, maybe we can check in the... Maybe tomorrow we can check the job office, see if I can find something else. Okay, here's the farming shop. I don't have, I don't know where I'm gonna farm, but I wish shops stayed open a little bit later than five. Uh, oh, home farming can be a good source of income and a great way to pass your free time at home. Buy some seeds to plant from farming products. Oh yeah, All right, it closes at five. Yeah, I wish not everything was closing at five. There's a museum. Mm. Oh, is that the city hall there? Yeah, we definitely got to check the um, farming shop tomorrow. That's going to be fun. We have all you need. Epic Jam. Oh, by the way, I've not been... I know my, my character is like athletic. He wants to do like athletic stuff, but I've not found the gym yet. 
Yeah, that's the thing. It's kind of hard. Well, it's kind of like how you when you move to a new city, right? It's kind of hard to know where everything is. So now I know where the farming store is. So tomorrow we're gonna check out the clothing shop, the farming store, and yeah, Syrian town. I've not been there, so maybe we can check that out tomorrow morning. Okay, travel. All right. So yeah, tomorrow we're gonna check. Okay, so many, so many things to do. It's kind of overwhelming in a good way. But honestly, I think I wish the days were a little bit longer. Um, maybe later once you have a car, it's not as bad. But yeah, I feel like I can only go to like one or maybe two places each day. Epic Gym sounds like Epic Games, which reminds me that Pelea is coming to Epic Games. And I don't know why people don't want to support it because it's on Epic now. Yeah, I was surprised on my last video when I talked about that. I just said that Pelea was on Epic Games. A lot of people were worried that the game was going to change or that they didn't want to support the game. But Epic is just a platform, so it's just like putting your game on Steam. I don't know. I don't know if there's something people know that I don't know. Like Epic is not publishing the game. They're not developing the game. They're they're just like working as a platform to host the launcher and the launcher is free, so I don't know. I don't know what's the I don't know, but there were at least three or four people that were worried, but I don't I don't know. I didn't want I don't I don't know. I'm personally worried about the pay-to-win aspect that Epic Games do, apparently. Yeah, well, that's probably the case with their own games, but... Pelia is not their game. They're just acting as a platform. It's like if you were saying, if you put a game on Steam... Being worried that Valve... Would... Have any impact on the game. It does not, right? It's just a platform. It's like saying that if you were putting your game on Nintendo Switch, that Nintendo would have an influence on the content of your game, right? So, I don't think it's going to change anything. It's because Epic Games is in a very good platform outside of North America, Europe. Oh, I see. Well, you can download it directly from Pelia.com, right? You can download their own launcher, so... Oh, Serene Town. Oh, that's the neighborhood with the academy. Oh, it's 4 a.m. I always forget about my needs. I need to use the toilet. Okay, oh my gosh. Let's go back home. I always go out in the morning. I forget my toilet. Um, I think some people want all of the games on one platform. I prefer Steam. Yeah, I mean, I personally, I definitely prefer Steam over Epic Games. I don't buy any games on Epic Games, and it's kind of a pain to, like... Use a different platform. So I get that. But you can get Pelia from like the Pelia launcher. So I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> uh, games like this end up costing a lot overseas without virtual wallets in the perspective countries' original pricing like Steam does. Yeah, I wonder if they're gonna change their pricing for like certain countries but yeah once again though it doesn't have anything to do with epic games uh i just want my launcher to get fixed the original launcher doesn't work on for oh well then maybe it's gonna maybe with epic games it's gonna work or maybe not because it's maybe it's gonna be just Kind of the same launcher, but just through Epic Games. So who knows? Maybe maybe it will work for you. Maybe it'll fix some issues. Epic Games is in a good platform, period. Their games in particular are extremely pay to win or even pay to play. Can buy the unfinished base game for full price, then double it for minor DLC. Yeah. But it's not their game though, right? Uh just continually approaching moving traffic is giving me anxiety. So sorry. <laughs> 
All right, let's use the toilet and then I need to fix my hunger. I still need to buy an instrument because I thought the microphone would count. I thought that singing would count, apparently not. Uh, I'm hungry, oh my gosh. Okay, uh, let's have some chocolate milk. Uh, white wine. Uh, okay, I need to fix my hunger. I'm gonna take a bath too. And all right, let's go out. We are busy. Okay, should we check the farming shop? Or yeah, let's check the farming shop. Then I got to go back to the music shop. I want to check the clothing shop too. Uh, Pedestrian shouldn't be affected at all. The game is not set up for money to have any real effect at all. Exactly. So I don't think it's gonna make any any difference. Uh, wasn't there a recent drama with Epic Games with one game dev because of their game? Honestly, I have no idea. Alright, let's go here. Yeah, I've not been so productive with my two days off. Tomorrow, we gotta go back. Gotta go back to the restaurant already. Oh yeah, I wanna check the the job office. I want to see if there's a new job I could I could pick up. All right, seeds. Okay, let's get. Ay ay ay, yeah, that's expensive. Tomato seeds. So one bag of soil, one small pot, and one tomato seeds. Three sixty. I have five fifty nine. Five ninety nine. I guess we don't have a choice. Oh, I have a strawberry cake, by the way. I should eat that. Okay. All right. Okay, so let's... Uh, let's try the farming at the end of the day when we come back home. Uh, for now... Oh! I shouldn't have bought... I shouldn't have bought those seeds. I thought I could continue playing. Um, Epic is not making games have microtransactions, please. It's just a storefront. Yeah. I mean, I don't know about their own games. I don't play any games that they develop or publish themselves. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to play more because it seemed like... It seemed like a very open-ended demo, so I thought... Uh, uh, well, thank you so much for checking out the demo version. We hope that you've had a wonderful time playing it. I really did enjoy it. Uh, it is still at an early stage of development, and there are still a lot of features we are planning to add, but with your feedback and support, we'll deliver the best version of this game. So if you guys want to check it out, uh, there's a link to their Kickstarter in the description. But let me see if I can reload my save file. I maybe just not pick up... I wonder if there's a time... Maybe there's a time limit of two hours and it just stops after two hours. <gasps> it didn't even save. It did not save because that's my... That was my other... That was my first playthrough, which is bugged. It didn't even save. Oh my gosh. I thought it was automatic saving. Maybe it saves when you quit, but because I never quit. <sighs> so next time I play this game, I'm going to have to start all over again. Again. <laughs> I'm going to have to start like a... I'm so cursed with this game. I'm loving this game so much so far. It's honestly a lot of fun. Uh, I'm a little bit cursed with their save files because it's... Uh, I'm going to try to quit the game, relaunch it. Uh, maybe it's going to be there, but... I'm really cursed with this game. I'm loving it, but it's not loving me back, unfortunately. Uh, to be fair, it's still an early alpha, but that's sad. Yeah. 
Yeah, next time I'll play, I'll have to create a new one again. Well, guys, I think that's going to be pretty much... Maybe we can choose another job options. Yeah, but by the time... Like, getting a job takes about, like, 30 to 40 minutes, so... Yeah, well... What should we do? I want to... Mm, Yeah. Okay, let me... I need to go turn on my AC. It's getting really hot. Uh, I need to think. I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, um, let's do, um, let's try to do another, I just want to check out a few more things. Let's just check out the city. Try to see if we can find like a clothing shop or other shops. See how far the criminal track has developed. Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to make it that far, though. Because it takes like 40 minutes to get there, right? So someone said play as a female character. Should we try to play as a female character? What's her name? Let me know her name, guys. You pick a name. Um, let's play as a blonde girl. I like this hair. Can have lips. I mean, um, no. I don't know what's that. Oh, it changes on the passport, but it doesn't change on the actual character. Okay, let's do these pink lips. Pants. Let's do a skirt. Let's do pink skirt. And what kind of top? Let's do a top like this. Be white. I don't like that the white is like so gray. Let's do blue. Should we do blue and I don't know. How should she what should she wear? What what should we wear? I don't know. Um Josephine. <laughs> Joshi. Josephine. Joshana. Joshella. Joshiana. So many good suggestions. Uh, let's see. No hat. She has nice hair. Identity. Okay. Uh, Jocelyn. Okay, let's do Josetta. And traits. I'm not going to play with her for too long. I just want to check out, like, the shops and the different things that we haven't seen. She's gonna be social, she's gonna be romantic, and fun. Yeah, that's her. And let's go. <laughs> pink, yeah, there's no pink clothes, so I wanna check out the clothing shop. So with her, we're gonna go get a credit card. And we're gonna go shopping. 
That's pretty bad that this save file didn't save at all to begin with. That's so sad, honestly. Like, I really liked my character. I was starting to make some progress. I was looking forward to keep playing with him more. Josh Lean. Yeah, maybe <laughs> that could have been cute. Ne next time. Well, next time. Ne next time I have to make a female character. This game is so fun, though. So far, I will say I'm really, really enjoying it. All right, two pixel yeah. Hot girl in the city with new credit card. Look out, pixel yeah. Yes. Watch out for Joshetta. Okay. Oh yeah, need to. All right. I know how to play. <laughs> it's my third time doing this. I know how it goes. Should we make her materialistic girl? Well, it's kind of ending up ending up like this because I want to check the shop. I don't want to like stereotype her too much, but the only thing left that I wanted to do was checking out more shops. So yes, that's 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 who she will be. Uh, Slay Josheta, find that rich man. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we'll be able. It takes a long time to build relationships in this game. But it would have been fun to go on a date, right? If you did drag, what would your stage name be? Oh, I never... I never... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. You tell me what would be a good name for me. I have no idea. Is this available to download? Uh, no. Uh, if you back it on Kickstarter, you will be able to play it whenever there's a playable build. Uh, but for now, they just sent this version to some content creators. So, and there's still like a few bugs and things like that. But there's not, there's not like a proper build uh, that everyone can play for now. Uh, all right. So, we, oh, it's raining. It's. Yeah, we get to see some new... Is there going to be seasons? Oh yeah, autumn. We're in autumn right now. It's so interesting to have a game that starts in autumn, right? Usually you always start in spring. So... Yeah, it's nice. It's a nice change. It doesn't look autumnal. It doesn't look too much like autumn. Like, the grass is green. So I hope the seasons will be a bit more, like, seasonal. A little bit more, like, looking different. Like, the trees are green. Now it's those clicky high heels walking sound for me. I'm loving this too much. But yeah, I wonder if her walking sound is the same as my as the guy. I think it's the same, right? Is it different? <laughs> is she wearing gloves? I think. She... I thought they were like bracelets, but they kind of do look like gloves. I don't like her outfit too much, honestly. That's why I want to go to the clothes clothing shop. Um, yeah. She's walking with purpose. Yeah, she's determined to go clean her apartment. All right. Oh, we're gonna have to meet Jane again. We're gonna have to make that strawberry shortcake again. Now, is that the only option for apartment? Uh, for the beginning of the game, yes. Uh, when you have money later on, you can move to other apartments. So this one is like really small and it's far away from everything. It's in the corner, far from everything. But yeah, there's maybe like 10 different options. There's quite a few options and you can buy too. So you can rent or buy. She looks like she should live in Diamond Heights. Herbs reference. 
Yeah. Oh my gosh. I, I need to go back to the herbs. We played that during a member stream a little while ago. I need to go back to it. We made so much progress playing the herbs in one stream. I feel like another stream we could finish the whole playthrough, right? So if someone's just jumping to the stream right now and wondering what, why I'm like speed running through everything, I already finished the demo once and now I just want to check the clothing shop. So I'm just kind of like doing everything uh, more quick. No saving button. Uh, I think it saves like maybe every time you quit. I'm not too sure why my first save file didn't save. Weird, it doesn't have an autosave feature. Yeah, well, it's just a very early alpha build, right? So the fact that there is some kind of saving is already good, but yeah, it's it's pretty early build of the game. All right, so I got my cake. Uh, should you see if it will save before you get too far? Um. I'm not worried about this one because I'm not gonna keep playing with that save file. It's just for today's stream. She's not gonna be like, it's just for today's stream. So just so we can check out more shops. So I'm not too worried about her. Uh, just drag name would be croissant because Quebec. Is that supposed to be like a croissant pronunciation? Uh, is that how I'm pronouncing croissant? Uh, the most important thing, can you pet the cat? Uh, there's a dog you can pet. I've not seen any cat. But, oh, the rain is heavy. Oh, yeah, there's one here. Is, it, is that a dog or a cat? But you can pet the animals. Did it talk? Did you guys hear? Oh, a wolf wolf. Okay, never mind. I, I thought it was like, it sounded like Mickey Mouse or something. No, it's just a wolf wolf. Oh, cross means badly behaved. Oh, that's why. Oh, I see. I'm not badly behaved, though. I'm always so good. Uh, pharmacy. Okay, that's not what I need. Okay, the clothing shop. Where's the clothing shop? The, there's just one thing I need. I want to see the clothing options. This guy's working on his laptop under the rain. <laughs> just like, no worries. What is he saying? I don't know if it is worth to get a college degree. These people are asking really the good questions, I feel like. Uh, okay. So last time... Where? I, I need to make a plan because I can't go in like too many places. Where did I not... Ch I feel like that upper street there, maybe I've not spent too much time on that street. In front of the park, did I check there? Maybe that little area here or here too. Okay, let's go in front of the park. Is that on the street that, yeah. If the animals could not be petted into the game, needs to go straight into the dumpster. If you can not pet the animals in the game, then it's automatically a turbo game. Yes, I agree. But yeah, no worries, you can pet them. There's no petting animation, at least for now, but you can. At least you get a little heart. Uh, I'm from Quebec and the joke confuses me. Oh, yeah, no worries. I didn't get it too, so don't worry. <laughs> I also, well, kind of didn't, well, kind of, yeah, anyway, <laughs> don't worry about it. Um, uh, French, Canadian, French, croissant. People mispronouncing croissant. That's the extent of my thought process. Yeah, it's... <laughs> uh, Good for trying. Thank you for trying. Um, I literally just got an achievement in BG3 for petting the dog and the old bear cub at the same time called. You have two hands for a reason. Oh, yeah. I saw that when you posted it on Discord.
Okay, here's the bed. Okay, let's get our card. But I need to find a shop. We say it differently here, croissant. <laughs> that is so cute. That sounds so cute. Croissant. A bank. Did I just get roasted by the stuff test <laughs> gamer on YouTube? Well, you tr I, I, I didn't mean to roast you. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> uh, achievement unlocked. <laughs> roasted by Josh. A light, light roast. Like a good... Light Rose. Um, okay. Um, art Studio. Where's the clothing shop? Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go there. Art Studio is the first time I see this. Why did that make me hungry, the Light Roast? <laughs> Lightly roasted with rosemary and shallots. Mm, that sounds good. Quick, the store closed at 5. Yeah, I think... I'll try to find it today. I may oh bookstore. Okay, we're approaching new area here. Delicious. Ooh, Papa Pizza Mia. Okay. Electronics, carpets, video. Okay, that's a new DVD movies. Uh that's a new area. I like this. Lots of new stuff. There's so many shops in this game though, right? But electronics for everyone. Where are the clothes? Pizza Mia. Bookstore. Are there more built? No, then it goes up to the other neighborhood. Okay, let's go back. Oh, 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 oh. I found it. Menswear. Oh, it's okay. Let's. I found a shop. Okay, I just want to see some clothes. It doesn't have to be women's wear, even if we're playing as a woman. Pix wears. Actually, I'm more interested in the men's clothes, so that's good. Uh, talk to Ruth. Well, actually, I think they're pretty much like... They're not really like gender locked, actually. So, there's a skull shirt. Green shirt, red shirt. I wish you could see them on your character. 400, that's expensive. That's expensive clothes. Tank tops. Green shirt with vest. They're all like very small, right? So it's kind of hard to see. Uh, did it end earlier because you bought farming seeds? What triggered it? Yeah, I don't know because it stopped at exactly two hours. So I don't know if it if the demo has a time limit, but actually I was two hours into the stream, so I was not two hours into that save file. So I don't know if there's like a time limit, but I think it ended because I bought the seeds maybe. So yeah, whenever they release that demo to the public, if it's the same demo, I would suggest don't don't buy the seeds. Because uh, there was definitely still a lot of content and a lot of things to do. Uh, so yeah. Uh, that crop top looks good even in three pixels. <laughs> yeah, I don't like the gloves though. Like, why does it have to come with gloves? I just want a crop top, like, just a tank top. No, tank top. Um, business shirt, red winter shirt, black t shirt. Oh my gosh, there's four pages. Sleeveless vest, blue hoodie. Yeah, it's pretty like basic. But with the amount of pixels, like, you can't expect too much stuff, right? Earrings. Oh. Yeah, that's expensive. Fedora hat. This looks more like a straw hat, right? Or something. Um, sleeveless. Sleeveless vest. Let me try the purple skull shirt. 
I want to play Fashion Dreamer. I'm so excited for Fashion Dreamer that comes out in two weeks. Exactly two weeks from today. And Dark Violet Pants. And let's put that on the credit card. And then you go here, close. Oh, I love how there's a different inventory for like your clothes. It is designed for men. Oh yeah, so. I don't think I can wear it. <laughs> I think maybe, are they gender locked? Oh no. Um, oh yeah. It is designed for, oh yeah. The clo- oh no, I can't even wear this now. Why? Oh, maybe a- mm. Okay, now I'm walking topless. Uh, how? I can remove things. I don't know how to put them back on. I can drag, I can't like left click, I can't right click. I'm pressing E, which is the button to like, the action button, it's not working. Clothes are gender locked. Well, I don't know. Well, they say it's designed for like this or that gender, but it doesn't. Um, so I don't know if they're really gender locked, but I'm not able to wear even my woman clothes I can't wear right now. So I'm not sure if I'm doing something wrong. So that's something they would have to like make clear or... But I'm pretty sure you can probably still wear them. I don't know. Maybe drag and drop. No, I can't drag and drop. Maybe they're locked for the demo. I mean, I can't wear anything. <laughs> I mean, if you remove something, can never wear it again. Um, maybe you need a mirror or something. Yeah, but then it's kind of weird. You can remove them, but not put them back on. Well, let's try that mirror there. No. Uh, I'm just going to walk in underwear for the rest. For the rest of the day, what, what should we check? Should we check the electronic store? Change on your house. I don't have any furniture in my house. There's nothing... Uh, there's nothing in the house for that. Uh, always. That was right here, right? Yeah, so maybe you need, maybe something, maybe it's like, just like placing the furniture. There's something I couldn't figure out. And I, here, if I'm trying, if I select it, press E. Drag, drop. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you need to buy a dresser, but it's kind of weird because you can remove them. Oh, 4.40 p.m. Ah, no, 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 no. I want to check out the shop before it closes. I wonder if you get into a shop before 5. Are they going to kick you out? Okay, I made it. I made it before 5. All right. Let's see what they sell. Jennifer. All right. So, computer. 1,500. 2,000. 4,000. So, yeah, the laptops are kind of expensive. But they're probably good for remote and stuff. Uh, fridge. Fridges. Microwave. Kettle. Oven. Toast machine. Toast machine. Uh, TV. I gosh, 5,000 for a TV. Uh, there's a radio. Radio, I don't know how much it costs because it's out of the screen. Coffee machine. Water dispenser. Office phone. This game feels very like 90s, right? With all these old computers and stuff. Yeah. Well, you know what, guys? I think that's going to be pretty much it. Is there anything else we should check out? Two realistic prices. Yeah, I know. Well, you, you can make money pretty quickly, though. Even with the first, like, restaurant job, I was making, like, over 500 per day. 
So I'm sure like once you have like a proper job, uh, it's not gonna be too bad. So you're walking around naked. Well, I have underwear, but yeah, it's probably not very appropriate, but hotel. Oh, you can buy a room. Hotels are built to satisfy your basic needs by providing a warm bed, bath, and toilet. You can place the furniture in a hotel room and customize it. If you're low on the budget, hotels are a good option to spend the night. What's the point, though? Because you have an apartment. Maybe if you lose your apartment, like if you don't pay your rent, maybe you have to stay here. Actually, it's much better than my apartment. Uh, still a lot of bugs, but I think we've seen almost everything except the other dreams. Yeah, honestly, I think we've seen pretty much everything we had to see for now, but... So, I'm gonna give you my final thoughts on this game. Well, my first thoughts on this game. Um, honestly, honestly, it's really fun. There is so much things you can do. I'm amazed by the amount of freedom that this game gives you. Like, all the different jobs, all the different traits. All the all the different mini games like the little arcades and the casino and like when you're singing and like the old dance mini game even like the, the dance mini game don't need some work because it was, it was really really hard but it's really fun um, only issues like yeah there are some bugs some issues like I can't put my clothes back on but overall it's been a lot of fun so. Yeah, if you guys want to back it on Kickstarter, feel free to check the link in the description. And yeah, um, so go to the club real quick. I don't think I don't know if I can go to the club if I've not like unlocked it. Maybe we can check it out. I don't want to do that dance mini game again though. But I wonder if the the club is gonna be unlocked. Uh, thank you for that conclusion. Seems fun. Yeah. I'm really, really enjoying it. And, um, yeah, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, tomorrow. I'm going to be streaming tomorrow at 1 p.m. Eastern Time. And, honestly, I have not decided quite yet. We may either finish. I'm still thinking about it. Debating. Oh, the club is the other way. Anyway. Oh, okay. I made it. Uh, I'm still kind of debating it. We might finish Rune Factory 3. Or actually, I think I'm not going to be able to finish Rune Factory 3. I think I need to grind a little bit more first. Yeah, I'm not too sure what we're going to play, but. Oh, I'm not allowed to enter. Okay, well, anyway, guys, that's going to be pretty much it. So thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this game. And yeah, I'll see you all next time tomorrow. Bye.